What if your phone knew what you needed before you even touched it? What if your glasses could see the world the way you think? At Google I.O. 2025, those what ifs turned into what's next. From your pocket to your face, AI just took a leap, and Google's Gemini is leading the charge. Let's break down the boldest innovation straight from Mountain View and see how Google is quietly rewriting the future. May 20th to 21st, 2025, Shoreline Amphitheater, right next to Google's HQ. The stage lights up as Sundar Pichai steps forward, joined by DeepMind's Demise Hasabis and leaders from Search Cloud, Android, and more. The energy? Electric. Developers from around the globe tuned in, ready for what's next. This year's theme is clear. AI isn't on the sidelines anymore. It's woven deep into everything Google builds. And leading the charge is Gemini AI. Not just a model, but the foundation now driving Search Android, productivity, and even hardware. Gemini AI has steadily evolved evolved from a capable language model into a core intelligence layer embedded across Google's ecosystem. It now powers Search, Workspace, Chrome OS, Android, and developer tools, making it more accessible and consistent across different user environments. Over 7 million developers are building with Gemini, five times more than last year, indicating growing trust in its reliability and integration capabilities. At the center of this growth is Gemini 2.5 Pro, Google's most advanced model yet. With a context window of up to 1 million tokens, tokens, it can process large volumes of information, such as code bases, research documents, or long-form reports in a single session. It supports multimodal inputs, meaning it can handle text, code, images, and audio simultaneously. In benchmarks like LiveCodeBench v5, Gemini 2.5 Pro has shown improvements in software development tasks, including debugging and code generation compared to previous versions. For enterprise use, Vertex AI has seen a 40 times increase in usage a sign that companies are finding practical value in integrating Gemini into workflows. In Workspace, it supports tasks like summarizing emails, organizing documents, and drafting messages. It doesn't take over the process. It offers suggestions and context, helping users move faster without losing control. Gemini's integration into everyday tools represents a shift toward more ambient AI. It's designed to work in the background, suggesting calendar changes based on meeting patterns, improving search results based on prior interactions, or surfacing relevant documents within your workflow. Rather than a standalone tool, Gemini is becoming part of the fabric of Google's user experience. Steady, functional, and increasingly adaptable. Now, with Android 16, Gemini's influence goes beyond apps. It's rewiring the core experience. Context awareness is now native. Your phone learns your daily rhythm, understands location, recognizes app habits, and connects the dots. Heading to the gym, it queues up your playlist and launches your workout app. Commuting home, it preps directions, dims distractions, and shows relevant podcasts. It doesn't wait for taps or swipes. It anticipates them. Gemini on device enables smarter battery use, local decision making, and offline task management. Android 16 becomes an active participant in your life, not just reacting to your input, but acting based on intent. Imagine scheduling a meeting without typing or setting a reminder just by finishing a call. That's the direction it's heading, turning smartphones into situationally aware assistants that evolve with you. The more you use it, the more fluid it becomes. Moving on to good old Gmail, Gemini is re-engineering how we communicate. The latest update introduces deeply personalized smart replies that go beyond canned responses. They scan your past conversations, your writing style, even attach documents, then craft replies that sound like you. Not any surface level mimicry, it's actually full context language modeling that captures your tone, your nuance, and your intent. It can switch between formal, casual, or concise based on what the moment calls for. Coming to Workspace subscribers later this year, this feature offers an entirely different kind of email support, one that blends speed with personality. All personalization runs under your control using on-device signals when possible with transparency at every step. It's productivity without compromise, giving you your time back while keeping your voice front and center. Next, the Gemini app itself has undergone significant enhancements as well, transforming it into a dynamic, multimodal workspace. Beyond text-based interactions, users can now input voice notes, images, and documents, enabling Gemini to provide summaries, rewrites, or strategic insights. For instance, attaching a UI mockup allows Gemini to generate corresponding composed code or explain the data flow of a UI screenshot. The app's interface adapts based on the task, be it writing, planning, or 
coding. With built-in memory and task tracking, Gemini recalls prior threads, retrieves relevant data, and continues conversations seamlessly. The integration of Gemini 2.5 Pro into Android Studio further enhances development workflows, offering features like natural language test creation and UI transformation based on provided images. Next, Google Search has been fundamentally transformed with the introduction of AI mode. This feature offers a conversational experience, allowing users to engage in back and forth dialogues. When posed with complex queries, AI mode doesn't merely list links. It generates structured interactive answers, often accompanied by charts, timelines, or pros and cons analyses. A notable innovation is the query fan out technique. Here, Gemini decomposes a user's question into sub parts, processes them in parallel, and synthesizes a comprehensive answer in real time. This approach ensures faster and more in-depth responses, especially for multifaceted queries. AI mode also introduces a personal context opt-in feature. With user permission, it integrates information from Gmail, Calendar, and Docs to provide tailored results. For example, when searching for places near me next weekend, it can surface your hotel reservation details. Privacy remains paramount with clear controls and transparency at every step. Some advanced features under testing include deep search, ideal for academic or technical explorations, pulling from scholarly sources and high quality content. Project Mariner automates repetitive tasks like data formatting, expense report generation, and form filling. Search Live integrates smartphone cameras for real-time object recognition and context-aware queries, such as translating menus or identifying plant species. These features are currently live in the US for Labs users, with broader rollouts anticipated later this year. Project Muhin signifies a significant advancement in wearable technology. Co-developed by Google and Samsung, this mixed reality headset operates on Android XR and is deeply integrated with Gemini's live AI capabilities. Unlike traditional AR devices, Muhin offers both immersive and context-aware experiences. Users can launch 2D apps from the Play Store and engage with fully 3D interfaces, such as manipulating architectural models or exploring spatial data visualizations. The headset employs outward-facing cameras and real-time environment mapping to understand physical surroundings, overlaying relevant information, be it fixing a car engine or browsing a grocery aisle. Gemini functions as a spatial assistant, answering questions, translating signage, suggesting actions based on visual inputs, and guiding workflows through audio and visual cues. This integration extends beyond the headset. These innovations underscore Google's commitment to embedding AI into everyday devices, making interactions more intuitive and contextually relevant. Google teamed up with Warby Parker and Gentle Monster to launch AI-powered smart glasses. Stylish and lightweight, these glasses run on Android XR and Project Astra's fast, multimodal AI. They translate speech, recognize objects and places, and summarize text, all in real time, designed to feel natural, not intrusive. Meanwhile, Project Starline is now Google Beam, an AI-first platform redefining communication. A key feature is Google Meet translations, real-time speech translation that matches a speaker's voice and tone. Available today in English and Spanish, with more languages coming soon. Google Beam also teased a 3D conferencing system using multiple cameras to create lifelike 3D images of users. Project Astra lives on as Google's universal AI assistant, with Gemini Live letting users ask questions about what their camera sees. This feature is rolling out now and will soon enhance Google Lens and Search, also serving as an accessibility tool. Not to mention, Project Mariner is an AI agent that completes tasks online. Now with multitasking for up to 10 tasks and a teach and repeat feature that learns from past actions to work smarter. Together, these technologies create a wearable interface that's proactive, private, and purpose-built, turning everyday tasks into seamless interactions with the world around you. Last but not least, Google introduced major upgrades in generative AI, headlined by Imagen 4 and Veo 3. Imagen 4 is the latest evolution of Google's image generation model, delivering sharper visuals and greater control. A key improvement is in how it handles text. AI-generated graphics with legible, properly placed typography have long been a weak spot, and Imagen 4 addresses that with much better consistency. It's now available in the Gemini app, Vertex AI, and tools like Docs and Slides. 
screens, supporting up to 2K resolution with improved accuracy in things like lighting and detail. On the video side, Google unveiled VO3, its most advanced video generation model yet. It powers a new creative tool called Flow, which lets users generate short video scenes with more realistic physics, movement, and even synchronized sound. Background noise, dialogue, and ambient effects are now part of the package. VO also enables editing features like object removal and dynamic camera angles, combining Imagine and Gemini's capabilities to create a more seamless AI filmmaking experience. So what if your phone knew what you needed before you even touched it? What if your glasses could see the world the way you think? At Google I.O. 2025, those what ifs became reality. What breakthrough surprised you most? Share below and subscribe for more AI updates.